been enjoying watching the live cast of the 2018 Lucas Oil Super Stakes. Joining me now is the newly crowned Unlimited Amateur Classic Champion, Gary Barker. It was a great run today and a great score. How does it feel to be a first time champion in the Will Rogers? Oh, it feels great. I'm glad I finally did it once. <laughs> How long have you been cutting, Gary? Oh, probably 15 to 20 years nearly. So it must be fairly satisfying then having it happen and having it happen so competitively. Oh yes, yeah, that was great. And on a horse that I'd raised, that adds to it. Yeah, that's a really special touch, I would imagine, because you've got really crossed off, ticked off two boxes there. Oh yes, definitely. Okay, tell us about uh, Smooth New, ba no, what have I got? Smooth, smooth new, new Cat, I'm sorry. Yes. Well, he's by Smooth as a Cat, our special new baby. Uh, Matt Gaines originally trained him. He made the finals at Futurity, Super Stakes, Derby, had a lot of success. And then I started showing him some last year and had a lot of fun with him. Okay, six-year-old? Six-year-old, yes. Okay, now when you were coming in, you were in the first set, you had a 221 to beat. So that's, that's a pretty good ask. What was your strategy? Oh, just go down and try and cut clean and just show my horse the best I could. It worked out for you. Did you take some risks there to get that 224? Uh, well, with that horse, the more you use him, the better he gets. And that's what makes him a lot of fun to ride. You let him have his head a little bit. Oh yeah, yeah. He's okay, fun. now in the second set, got very competitive. There was a 223 and a 223 and a half. How were you feeling at that point? Well, to be honest, I wasn't in here. <laughs> I didn't know till I got through with the, I was over to the other building in a meeting and when I got through then my wife called me and told me that I'd won. So perhaps that's the strategy to calm the nerves as you're waiting it out, just don't watch. Yeah, that's the best thing. <laughs> okay, now you've also been um, a futurity champion in terms of a horse that you bred, uh, second spot a couple of years ago when he won uh, with Matt Gaines. How does that differ? What was that feeling like? Oh, uh, that to me was actually more special. I mean, that's what you strive for, to raise and own an open futurity champion. So I don't think anything will top that. Okay. And tonight's run, do you remember much of it, like your cow choice and, um, you know, how it felt as you went through that run? Oh, yes. Uh, red baldy first and then uh, sort of a gray brownish mop and then a red one with a black face. And Lloyd picked my cows. He's a great cow picker and we started up through trying to get the gray one first and he's like no the red baldy's up on top go with it so you know I just listened to my help which you know they're great Jamie and Clay and then Casey. You trust your advice? Oh yes. Advisors? Oh yes definitely. Yeah they never tell me wrong. Okay uh, what's what's next for you in the uh, Super Stakes? Uh, I'm through I'm going home. You can enjoy yourself and celebrate now. Yes yes. Well congratulations thanks for joining us. Thank you very much.